Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Good evening, esteemed colleagues and fellow researchers. This is Mahfouz al-Sabbagh, PhD student at Modern College of Business Administration, working as an academic faculty member in various universities and college with more than 27 years of experience in various fields and industry. It's my pleasure to be with you today in this virtual conference. I would like to thank the organizers and my professor, Dr. Mohammed, and my colleagues providing me this opportunity to present my research paper. Today, I'm excited to delve into a critical aspect of organizational dynamics within higher education institutions focusing on employee engagement. As a dynamic driving force to achieve organization performance, here to start with, we need to focus on the concept itself, the concept of employee engagement. Now, the concept coveting in shape not only the fabric of the academic um, academic environment, but also significant, uh, significantly affect and influence the educational outcomes. Employee engagement, it is capsulated the sense of how educator and supported staff, administration, administrative staff also, interact with their role and institutions. Focusing on the definition of employee engagement as it is stated by Khan as an initial, this concept was introduced taking into consideration the employee engagement as employee emotion, commitment, and active involvement and also the organization and its goal. So looking at it from three different angles, from emotional angle, from involvement angle, and from organization. And from other side, looking at the organizational performance, which represents the organization overall effectiveness, where the performance have been touched on non-financial base. Considering this definition, the focus is on the emotional and psychological bound between employee and their work, and also with the organization, which we are referring here, the higher education institutions. Employee engagement definition vary based on various themes energy and motivation from one angle, as it is uh, uh, introduced by uh, Khan and uh, Scaffold. And then those definition were focused on so that the whole research will be based on the definition which we selected. I'm going to highlight on the gap due to the lack of, due to the low engagement level in higher education institutions. And after retrieving the literature to cross check the gray literature, we found that there is a significant gap in empirical uh, uh, b b there is a significant gap in the literature and also as an observation, many institutes face difficulties and ch challenges toward maintaining the level of uh, engagement within the employees as a faculty member and administrator staff. The result of this engagement will reflect on organization performance as a consequence of low um, uh, engagement will be decreasing in job uh, satisfaction, increasing in turnover rate and undermining organizational performance. The research started with 
finding out this gap. And then the research question is to what extent do employee engagement factor influence organization performance in higher education institution in Oman? So the, the main focus is Oman as a context. The hypothesis, which is drawn as employee engagement significantly impact on organizational performance. Looking at different theories and different literature and coming up with the conceptual uh, framework from the literature and after retrieving the theories, we found I found that there are certain theories which can be embedded in this research to have an alignment between the research objective and the conceptual framework which is drawn. From one end, the variables which is taken into uh, the variables which are taken into consideration as uh, independent variable, which is in employee engagement. We uh, I have taken the vigor as a workplace energy and the dedication, the work, and absorption as a work focus. All three subverbals will impact on organizational performance and based on the dependent variables and outcomes of organizational performance, the second, uh, the, the, the research methodology is used in order to come up with those alignment. Now in research methodology, I have used the quantitative method as an approach to collect the data, questionnaire was designed, taking into consideration the three sub variables and organization performance also. Now, the instrument which was reflecting on those variables was uh, taken from the green from the literature, and also it was adopted and adapted due to uh, the context and the employee engagement as a variables have been taken as a question items from the RTH work engagement scale where uh, uh, items related to uh, vigor and absorption and dedication was taken from those uh, question and also for organizational performance it was taken from the same sources. The data collected through questionnaire online and the targeted population was 40 due to the limitation and constraint of the time. Uh, we focused on 40 and uh, there is a limitation taken into consideration as an acknowledgement that uh, the uh, sample size could be more in terms of uh, generalizable, and then also it is uh, it can be reflected on other uh, elements too. The data collection and analysis in this research data collected through online survey, as we say, then it was coded and analyzed using a statistical software SPSS. The questionnaire, as we said, at the items analyzed based on the variables, employee engagement uh, as a workplace. The sixth item was taken from the questionnaire and it was analyzed where the grand, uh, where the grand uh, mean was equal to 3.96 and the grand the standard deviation was 0 0.2. For dedication, work commitment, five question was taken as a grand mean 4.04 and the grand standard deviation was 0 0.206 and for the third uh, item as a variable absorption the work for uh, the work focus six item was taken and the grand mean for that was 3.74 and grand uh, standard deviation 0 0.206 for the in the, uh, for, for the dependent variable organizational performance, five item was taken again with a grand mean 3.7 and grand standard deviation 0 
Karima, are you uh, keeping track of the of the time? Yeah, till now he is uh, spending uh, ten minutes. Good. Just uh, let him know and then. Good. Go ahead. Fine. Now regarding regarding the uh, regarding the findings. The quantitative analysis reveals a statistical significant positive relationship between employee engagement level and organizational performance, which indicates in higher education institutes. Now, specifically, a higher level of employee engagement were associated with, uh, uh, with increased student satisfaction rating, improving faculty retention rate, and also enhancing the institute institutional reputation score. The implication which we are uh, looking for here as a result uh, as a research uh, findings and result it shows that the underscoring underscore underscoring the importance of fostering a positive work environment that promote employee engagement with higher education institution. This reflects on the investment need to be made by initiating different program, training programs and to enhance employee engagement with the prof professional development opportunities and transparent uh, communication also channels and recognizing uh, recognition of uh, different training program focusing on fostering the engagement of uh, um, engagement of the, the staff now there are certain uh, recommendations which we can conclude based on the quantitative analysis the recommendation, uh, the recommendation for higher uh, education institution is to prioritize the strategies aiming at enhancing employee engagement level, which includes implementing regular feedback mechanism, providing opportunities for skill development and career advancement, fostering uh, supportive organization culture, and aligning institutional goals with individual goals. Coming to the end. Uh, Mr. Mahmoud, uh, Mahfoud, yes. you are remaining only with five minutes now. Yeah, I just completed. Thank you very much. If you have any question, any clarification, please 